Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you a quick and easy hack so you're able to filter your database items in Bubble via country and specifically geographic addresses that are countries. If you're watching this video, you probably have the same problem that I have here, which is that if you try to filter your listings via specific cities, it works, but the moment you input a country, nothing is returned. This is actually because uh, Bubble uses single points for addresses, so it's picking the middle points geographically of the area that you're adding as a geographic place here. So just to make sure we're starting on the same page, uh, you have items that you're going to look through and you have a repeating group of them and you're filtering them. Um, so you're looking for the address of your things, which is within a specific radius of the location that you're going to input in your search box. Uh, for the search box, you connected the Google Maps API. That's always going to be needed. To get the best results, the best way to fix that would be by using actual API calls. So you can use the geocoding API in order to return a box that will have four coordinates in total. So you are looking for something over an area. So I found another quick and easy fix, which is probably less complete, but it still works. And what we're going to do is that we're going to use a different data source in the conditions if the city is empty. I'm also checking uh, that the search box value is not empty. So it's really only if there is something in there, but the city is not there. And here I'm going to reuse the same data source that I had, but I'm going to remove uh, the thing filtering for the address. And instead, I'm going to add here filtered. And inside this filter, I'm going to use advanced. And here I'm going to check that this thing's address uh, right here is actually I mean, extracting the country first, that one is important. So you extract, extract the component's country from there, and then you make sure that it contains the value that is in the search box. So the, yeah, the location that the users are looking for. So I'm going to pick the value. And here again, you need to make sure that you extract the country only. So this actually works for countries and cities specifically, but if you want to make that work with neighborhoods or, um, I don't know, zip codes or things like that, you can just use as many conditions as you need. And we're just going to test it out. So remember before I was te uh, yeah, testing in France, Paris, my listing shows in Lyon as well. But now, yeah, I got uh, both listings that are in France overall and the type is country. So I hope this tutorial was useful for you. Uh, make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. And of course, feel free to ask your questions if you have any left. Thank you. Bye.